I'm Erica Gray and this is the Twist News and I am in Germany at the Rundstag Synagogue. Now it is Saturday so it is the Sabbath so Don is inside praying and he's attending a service but I'm going to talk a little bit about this synagogue and also about anti-Semitism, which you can feel the effects with what I'm going to describe to you. But first, let's take a peek at this beautiful synagogue. And you can see it. It's beautiful. Well, this synagogue, the Rundstag, is the only surviving synagogue from World War II. And it was pretty much destroyed, but able to be reconstructed. The only one that survived from the Holocaust and what happened in Germany. But I want you to also notice, as we've talked about on this show, anti-Semitism and its effects. I just visited that synagogue and going inside, what happened is First, they check your passports and they check your identity to make sure that you don't have any weapons. Second, you go through a locked door that someone has to let you in and another locked door. And this is tragic. Not only that, but you could see that there is a police car. There's two police cars there. And you also see here another police car. And this is sad. This is because of anti-Semitism, because of terrorism in Europe, and this is what our Jewish friends have to live through and have to do because of the anti-Semitism. So this is a brief show and I've got some doggies running around in front of me and uh, I think they're about to fight. Uh, while I'm doing this broadcast, so excuse me for having been distracted. But this is my report for today to show you, one, the beauty of this synagogue and the fact that it has survived is a miracle, but also what our Jewish friends have to go through. The security is shocking. There's no other place that you go to in Germany where you go through that kind of security, but in this Jewish synagogue. And again, I'm going to show you this police vehicle that is on watch, and you also have the two police cars, not to mention the layers of security within the synagogue itself. Well, this has been Erica Gray with the Twist News. I am waiting for Don, and if you don't subscribe to our channel, please subscribe to our channel today and be sure to also check out our Amazon store where we have various products including products from Israel and also have books from our distinguished guests. So stay tuned till next time.